there's a lot of danger of being LGBTQ. At the end of the day, there's going to be people who are not going to like what you do. And you just need to know that it's okay for them to critique you, but it's not okay for them to hate on you. Hi, my name is Desi. I identify as gender fluid and I use she, they pronouns. What I fight for is to help LGBTQ youth. What motivates me to do what I do is the impact that it has and how it can help others learn about themselves and how it can help me learn about myself. And I just like being able to inspire others to be themselves because growing up, I did not, you know, I had that inspiration from people like Paul. And I want young kids to have that inspiration to be themselves like RuPaul did for me. I got into drag from RuPaul's Drag Race because my mom would watch it from a young age when I was little. And I would always be very inspired by, you know, how they dressed. And, you know, I was at a young age, so I didn't know that they were drag queens. It just really was inspiring to me because, you know, it taught me that I was not the only one out there who was different and that there were other people out there who liked to dress differently. The first time I went out in drag was in 2014, I just thought they were, you know, princesses and I wanted to be just like them. I thank drag for helping me discover who I am and who I identify. You've learned that they are not the only ones out there and to fight for LGBTQ rights because during this time there's a lot of, you know, danger of being LGBTQ and um, I want you to know that it is okay to be different and that it's not a bad thing. Some of the challenges and backlash I faced are saying that I'm too young to be doing this or that I'm being abused by my parents, which, you know, I just think is ridiculous because thinking about it, you know, I, it was all my choice. My parents, you know, sometimes they discouraged it, but I wanted to go out in a, in drag, um, in public because it made me feel special. It made me feel beautiful. And that's what, you know, is special about that. But at the same time, at the end of the day, there's going to be people who are not going to like what you do. And you just need to know that it's okay for them to critique you, but it's not okay for them to hate on you. And don't let them get to you because you are you. And as long as you're not... Be yourself always no matter what anyone says and pay the haters no mind because they'll never be as fierce as you and I. And don't be afraid to, I guess, grow up or don't be afraid to grow up or learn new things or experiment because as I've matured over time, you know, I've learned a lot of new things and, you know, I've gotten more of a thicker, like, shell from bullying. So just know that over time, things will get better and to always love yourself and never let anyone take advantage of you, play you, or just ruin your confidence because that all that and it just makes you feel better because I'm helping these kids or just people in general learn that they are not alone and they, they were not alone um, at a young age. I am Desi and I hope everyone has an amazing day. Bye!